preparation was what? Like this second lap was made unilaterally. But he gave money. And a project that will be executed by the body. Reparations is not only about repairs. But that kind of stereotype approach. When the church believes that it can do what it wants to do, before any respect to the agency that the government set up, have discussions or reparations. It is not going to be a big issue. We have no authority to see if they will execute the project. We don't have any authority to manage it. They will not pass money into the hands of any state agency. The government has set up task forces across the Caribbean to play a specific role. You can't just invite me or Corleone they don't have respect for the task force or my office or re re uh, reparation or economic enfranchisement. It can't be done that way. And then you call me or call Corey and invite him. You go there, sit down, and then you exactly endorse the project and you don't know anything about it. And then you get people at this time in our history. When you see what is happening in Niger, you see what is happening all over the world, you see how these people are manipulating, you see how these people are coming up with counter strategies. We got to protect the interests of our people. Sure. They can't make any unilateral decisions and exclude government in the planning. When the government has undertaken a responsibility to address issues on reparations across Barbados, even if they had the goodwill of the public and everything, you know very well how the poor fools should behave before. You know what the priests did when they went on the African continent. You know what they say when they recommend black people as the people best suited to be enslaved? Mm -hmm. We got to be suspicious. You got to talk to us. I am not, and I don't want to be in charge of any poor department where people can do what they want to do and laugh 